Hello mga katong, welcome to Thomas Sessions Virtual Mixology Competition brought to you by Apotheki Craft Spirits, distributor of Plantation Rum and Barsmith, Barsmith PH. So, we have 12 contestants who uploaded 5-minute videos of their Tiki-inspired cocktails here in Thomas Sessions' channel. Now, we need your participation. How? First, view this video in its entirety. Second, like the video. Third, leave a comment. Fourth, share it to your friends. If you have 5,000 friends in Facebook, 10,000 friends on Instagram and Twitter, then that will surely help. Because on December 5, 6 a.m., we will do a cutoff and we shall start counting the final views from top 1 until top 12. And this will be converted as a point of their marketing savvy for the live presentation here in Thomas Sessions live stream, 1 p.m. That's a Saturday. We hope you can join us. It's going to be fun. It's going to be exciting. It's going to be historical because this is the first time we're going to have bartending mixology format online and for students format your views will ensure and help our advocacy and that is to make sure that the bartending industry will be alive through the eyes of the students which are the future of the industry so what are you waiting for enjoy the video and tomana Hi everyone, my name is Andre Del Rosario, a student from University of Santo Tomas, and today I'll be making my very own Tiki Cocktail. Now, the founders of Tiki Cocktails and Tiki Bars were Don Beach, Vic Trader, and Mariano Lucidini. As I researched about Tiki Bars and Tiki Cocktails, I discovered that it wasn't really meant to represent the Polynesian culture. What the three guys wanted to do was to bring that island vibes, nautical vibes, and just a place where you can escape from a week of work. Given the situation that we are in, which is the pandemic, we all have that ideal place where we wanna go or go back. Personally, I miss UST. I miss those small conversations with strangers at Laxon, walking around UST campus, and simply, simply hanging out with my friends. Now, those carefree moments is what I want to represent in my drink. Okay, now, let's start making our drink. First, you need to chill your glass. Always chill your glass so you can serve it cold. Or chill. <laughs> Background music. Okay. Now, to start with our drink, our first ingredient ingredient is tamarind juice. In Tagalog, Sampalok juice. As a connection where USD is located, which is Sampalok, Manila. So, we're gonna use 90 ml of tamarind juice. You can make tamarind juice by boiling tamarind. By, in, by 30 minutes or just simply buy from your supermarket. Next ingredient is 30 ml of pineapple juice. Third ingredient is calamansi juice. We're gonna use 10 ml. Okay. Next ingredient is star anise syrup. What I did is incorporate star anise to simple syrup. I used three or four uh, star, star anise pieces and boiled it at least 30 minutes. Now we're gonna use 15 ml of star anise syrup. Now, this uh, ingredient represents the sweetness that you will get at the end of this whole uh, situations that we, we are in. Last ingredient is we're gonna use plantation original dart. And we're gonna use uh, 45 ml 
So I chose this um, rum because it has that fruity notes which goes well with our drink. Oops. Which goes well, which goes well with our drink. <laughs> now let us throw the cocktail. We're gonna use the throwing technique. Last, last one, last one. Okay. Now, you can put this aside, then discard the ice from your chilled glass. Get your crushed ice. Oops. Of course, before pouring your drink, you need to taste it. Quarantiki. Yeah. 